Greetings YouTube. I received a request to explain how to add designs to Sew so Pro so that you can edit them. Please stay tuned so that you can get the very simple explanations. This video is a quick pick tutorial for Sew so What Pro. So What Pro is an embroidery design editing software program. This tutorial will benefit those who machine embroider or wish to learn more about it. You should already have a machine and have purchased designs to fully benefit from this video. This quick pick tutorial will be for opening designs in So What Pro. Adding your designs in Sew so Pro is easy, and there is more than one way to do it. Let's jump right in. There are several different ways to open up designs in Sew so What Pro. We're going to use Sew so What Pro for the first way. Here's my icon, my shortcut for Sew so What Pro. Let's open it up. When we open up Sew so What Pro, you will have a tip box that pops up. Keep these. I highly suggest that you do not stop these from opening because these tips are super helpful. Okay, so when you close out the tips, you have a blank slate in Sew so What Pro. Opening a new design for editing is as easy as going up to this picture of a folder and clicking it. After using Sew so What Pro to edit designs, clicking Open will open the last embroidery design folder that you worked with. How easy was that? Let's close this for now. And now we'll see two other ways to do the same thing. This way, you can choose which is more comfortable for you. We first clicked this folder icon, which when we hover over it, we see it says open. But notice also there is a tool tip for opening designs. Notice it says control plus O. Control plus O means hold down your control key, which are the keys on your keyboard under your shift keys. Then press the letter O while still holding down your control key. Control O. And notice the same folder opens up for you to choose a design from. There's another way. Let's go up to File, which is up here in the toolbar. File, then select Open three different ways to get to your design folder. Do you remember them? The first way is to click this picture of the folder. The second way is to press Control plus O on your keyboard. The third way is to go up to File, then select Open. Once you get to your design folder, you can navigate to the design that you wish to edit. Now, before we address the second method of opening up a design file, let's make sure that So What Pro is set up correctly. Navigate up to the top of the toolbar for So What Pro. Now we wish to click Options. Once you click Options, let's go down to File Associations. When you click here, the box that opens shows all of the embroidery design file extensions available today. Here's Milko. Here's Kenmore. Notice down here is Janome. Well, I have Brother Machines. So my file type is right here, P-E-S is in Sam. Now, although my machine can only use P-E-S, I found it super helpful to keep all of these file types selected. 
Why? Because there have been times I found an embroidery design that I loved, yet it was not in PES file type format. By keeping all of these options checked, So What Pro will open the design I want and then allow me to save as the file format that my machine uses. Isn't that handy? I just love So What Pro. Okay, so let's be sure that all file extensions are checked by click, clicking Select All, if you haven't already. Click OK, and we're done. Now, let's close out So What Pro. Our next method of opening a design in So What Pro involves going to the design you wish to edit. Here is my embroidery design folder. It's a bit easier for me to open a design using this method because I can easily scroll through my designs with a full screen as opposed to the smaller window through the So What Pro program. Let's see. Let's choose this design to edit. If you double click on the design, So What Pro will automatically open your design in the editing workspace. From here, you can continue on to editing your design as you please. So in review, opening designs in So What Pro is easy. You can either use So What Pro by going up to File, then Open, clicking on the picture of the folder, or by using Control plus O on your keyboard. Or the other way is by going to the design itself, double clicking on it, and So What Pro opens for you. As always, we appreciate you tuning in to our channel. If this tutorial was helpful, please hit the like button. That will also make it easier to navigate back to this video if you need a refresher. Also, please subscribe. We will be adding more So What Pro tutorials as they are requested. Keep the questions coming. We enjoy the feedback. Until next time, Enjoy your embroidery.